Team Israel, but also goes around all over the world. Um, basically, when all of you will uh, you know, be CEOs of major companies, you will have to go through a strategy uh, to establish your strategy, right? And the strategy consulting process is basically a three-phase process where we start with the strategy analysis, then we have strategic recommendations, goals and directions, and then you have the plan, of course, the implementation plan. Sorry, it's, it's, it's a lot of details. So, as a, as a division, we go through with our clients, our big clients, major clients, not startups, we go and deliver the whole, this whole process. The strategic analysis is built on two kinds of work that we have to do. Okay? That's, there's the external analysis, which is basically saying we're analyzing your market, um, we uh, give it a size, we analyze the trends, we analyze, uh, by the way, when I say trends, I mean every kind of trend, uh, regulation trends, uh, technological trends, climate behavioral trends, everything that affects your market for good and bad. Market size and forecast in terms of revenues, so how much money is there in the market, in your addressable market, this is very important. A lot of startups present market size, which is not necessarily their market, it's the current market, or it's a bigger market that we are working under, so we will take some percentage of it. We, you need in your business plan, and I will get into it uh, in a few minutes, you need the market size of your potential market, okay? So for example, e-wallets for gambling, let's take the second example. E-wallets for gambling has a market size, we know it. Our client did it. Okay? It's not whole payment method market for gambling. That's what he used to present. Okay? That billions and billions of dollars worth of market. Where e-wallet for gambling is something completely different. It's a lot narrower, it's a lot smaller, obviously. And each of you should know that the addressable market is something that is very important to assess, evaluate, and to give a forecast. And that's where we come in. 